So what happened today? Uh, well, I went in for my last day on board Texas ever, and I got an award. An award. I got a Navy or Marine Corps Achievement Medal for my time. That is awesome, babe. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. I love you. So in this video, we decided to let you know a little bit about our cross-country road trip coming up. So exciting! So if you didn't know, we are getting stationed in South Carolina from Hawaii and the last couple of weeks or months have been a blur to get to this point where we are finally getting to the next chapter in life. The Navy will only ship one of our cars. So we had to ship Val's car out of pocket. Kind of sucks, but it opens up this awesome possibility that we saved a little bit of money on shipping her car. We only shipped it to LA, which means we are going to road trip across the country, the whole country. Mm -hmm. So to ship my car, the cost was a thousand fifty nine dollars to ship it from Hawaii to LA which is not terrible but if we shipped it from here to South Carolina where we're eventually going to end up it costs another two three thousand dollars maybe and the guaranteed date of it getting to where we need it to be at that time is more varied so we decided instead of spending that money on shipping that we would actually spend that money driving across the country to get that experience. So cool. Because why not? So we are going to fly to LA and then stay overnight because we get there late. And then in the next morning we're going to pick up my car in Long Beach, California. From there we are going to drive her car, or drive Val's car from LA to Las Vegas for a night where we're gonna stay at the Excalibur. Excalibur. We plan to stay there until the next afternoon where we will start a very, very long trek to Albuquerque. Wanna stop in and see my Aunt Karen and Uncle Dave at, at the very least for a couple hours and just visit and see them because I haven't seen them in a couple years. So it'll be nice to sit down and catch up. I really need to call them. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Yeah, I should probably do that this weekend. So the drive from Las Vegas to Albuquerque is about eight hours. And when we leave there, our next stop is Austin, Texas. From Albuquerque to Austin, Texas is an 11 hour drive. So we're gonna have two really long days of driving. Well, one, we could do one long day and one, one short day. Yeah, we're gonna have to. Yeah. figure that out it'll be all right Austin we are just visiting the city because I hear it's awesome and uh, I've always wanted to check it out we're gonna get some food and explore a little bit and then we're back on the road and it's a very short drive to Houston Texas where we're going to hang out with Val's friend Val's and my friend Brittany so we are going to yeah visit our friend Brittany who lives in Houston, she used to live here. She's one of my best friends in the entire world. I actually went to visit her in Texas. Without this, me. Without him, because he was in Japan. And it was Valentine's Day and he was not here because he was deployed. So I will the, leave- the, That's irrelevant. That's very relevant. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I'll leave that video below where I visited Texas for the weekend. You know, just enjoy a little bit more of a downtime, but exploring with a friend and we're gonna stay at our apartment. So it's it's less like hustling and more just kind of like a relaxed point after a lot of driving the couple days before. Yeah, and while we're there, I wanna check out the Battleship Texas too, because it sounds really cool. From Houston, we're probably gonna leave Monday morning and then we are going to head to New Orleans. And both of us have never been there. And when I was deciding to actually go and have my eat, pray, love moment and figure out where I wanted to live, I ended up choosing Hawaii, but New Orleans was one of the things that, or one of the places that I wanted to maybe plant myself for a couple months because the food culture was really active then. And um, we're just gonna check it out maybe for a day, probably stay overnight. And then we're going to head to 
Well, also of note with her eat, pray, love moment, um, she was thinking about going to Colorado as well, which is kind of interesting because if I hadn't joined the Navy and Val hadn't gone to Hawaii, there was still a chance that we would have met in Colorado, which I think is really cool. But I also think it's cool that we met in the middle of nowhere. I think it's cool that we had the possibility to meet in a, in a couple different places. Our paths were destined to cross. Oh. From New Orleans, we're going to head to Gulf Shores, Alabama, um, and Mobile. So in Mobile, there's another battleship that I want to check out, Battleship Alabama. Um, that'll be pretty cool. Um, same thing. I enjoy touring Navy ships also. I'll leave it's, the Rimpack video down below also. It's, it's kind of nerdy, honestly. I'm a nerd. And after that, we are going to try and head to Atlanta, Georgia to visit Mike's grandparents and some of his family over there, which we also did during our Skinner Summer Road Trip last year. Um, at this point, the timing is gonna get a little weird and depending on how long it takes to get to certain places and how tired we are, we're gonna kind of figure things out on the go. Uh, but I feel like, but I feel like we're, we are gonna stop at, like for a night at growing pawpaws. Okay. Yeah, I mean, we have time. Um, from Atlanta, we are going to eventually head into Charleston. Which is um, only like a six hour drive. Yeah, it's pretty it's short, pretty probably comparatively to what we're, yeah. we're doing. But um, once we get there, we're going to stay with some friends and our number one goal is to rent a house and quickly one, very quickly and once that happens our stuff will be coming in but at that point and we'll be able to start a new chapter during the holidays so and shortly after that i'll be going back to work so with this road trip it's important that we kind of didn't set so many expectations obviously we do have a time limit and um, a dollar limit that we're working with but mike and i one of the best things that we do together is travel and explore new places and we found through the few years that we've been together that traveling without any expectations of a place has been the best because we're not thinking about how it could have been or should have been and if it's or a what bad we missed out on right or, and if it's a bad experience then it's just we we didn't know that going into it and a lot of times it ends up being the opposite where we don't think something's going to be as great as it is and it's great so that is what you have to look forward to for the next couple of weeks on skinner tv we're going to a lot of places we're going to get a lot of footage and uh it's going to be a new experience for both of us i've never road tripped across the country i've only gone like up and down like the east coast but i've never gone across anywhere so it's going to be super interesting so there's going to be a lot of footage and i'm going to have a lot of work to do editing so i'm going to try to keep the videos monday wednesday friday just like our usual schedule and we'll see what happens from there and of course we're going to take videos and as we're getting settled and exploring charleston and literally everything we do in life because YouTube is really fun for us. It really is. I've really enjoyed making these videos with Belle. He's been fun. All right, guys. Well, I hope you are excited for watching our road trip just as we are excited for going on it. Um, it's going to be an adventure. Things might not work out the way we are saying or the other way around. I don't know. We're kind of open-ended, so we'll see how this goes. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, subscribe down below and we will see you guys on the road.